Hey guys, welcome to Travel with JT. As you know, Teresa and I are slowly traveling around the world, and today we want to take you to the Parthenon, found at the top of the Acropolis Mountain in Athens. Now before we start, if you guys are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button and click on the notifications to see more of our travel videos. So guys, what do you think of when someone mentions Greece? Most of us think of all the Greek islands, like Mykonos, or even Santorini. And the list goes on and on, though I think of architecture, history, democracy, and most of all, our favourite, food. The Parthenon is a former temple dedicated to the goddess Athena. It was built in 440 BC. And as you can see from the rugged terrain, it's actually a bit of a walk to the top. So getting to the top, it's about a 20 to 30 minute walk. It's quite hot. It's in the middle of summer when we went. Um, entry cost, we bought tickets online and we kind of tried to jump the queue, but it's only, it only works out to about $30. Um, or about 20 US dollars to get in. For me, coming up to these steps, you know, when you're just about to go right up to the entrance, knowing how many, you know, amazing people have been there before, obviously good and bad, you kind of get um, quite starstruck, I suppose, um, especially if you're really into your ancient history. You'll notice here there's a lot of work underway um, in Athens to rebuild the Parthenon and uh, every time I've come back I've noticed they've done more work which is really really good to see. Okay so how did it end up like this? Well here it goes. So they booted out the Greek gods when the Christians came through with the Catholic Church and later the Turks invaded and made it into a mosque as seen here in this image. Later, the Venetians decided to bomb it um, when they invaded, but not knowing that the Turks had actually stored ammunition inside it, which actually blew up the lot. You know, it's such an amazing place that has gone through so much, so many invasions, and yet it still stands today. Guys, if you're really into your history, you definitely have to go see the new museum. Um, it's not far from the Parthenon, it's just down the bottom from the Parthenon, or walking distance. But they've actually built the museum on top of the old city and they've kind of put glass on the ground so you can actually walk over it and see the old ruins. It's absolutely amazing. Um, check it out, look it up, it's just a really, really nice museum.
guys for watching to the end and if you haven't subscribed to our channel please hit the subscribe button so you can see more of our travel videos um, please also remember to follow us on Instagram it's at travel with underscore JT and please leave a comment if you like the video if you want to see anything else see you next time and keep traveling Thank you.